Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day, a rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature. circumstances that exist when these two meet. Losing really isn't an option, making this another intense, feisty clash, which should keep everyone on edge. The fans are more nervous than the players to me, confirming an atmosphere of, of angst. Try telling them there's nothing riding on this. So it's down to business here. Gundogan. Sterling drives it forward. Over to the left. Plays it in. And out to safety. De Bruyne. Martial. Fred. Gabriel Jesus. Sterling, Sterling! Mares. Well, oh, that is up, gets up to head it! A oh, great save, real class. De Bruyne simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Back to the keeper and go again. Clears it out of harm's way. Manchester United get it back again. Looks to clip it forward, and he's on his way! It's Gabriel Jesus! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. And the defence was completely beaten then. Exploiting that space in behind has proven very effective for them in this game. It's good stuff. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Uh, that was just poor decision making and a weak execution. He gets past his man, lobs it in gently. Juan Bissaka gets it away. Shaw attempts a clearance. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Rashford. And helps available out wide. was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Pressure stays on, it is a corner. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. Now it's Sterling. Sterling! Defence has got rid of that. That'll be a throw. Now 
Mares goes for the cross. Tries to get it clear. This has gone, that's a foul. And he has shown him a yellow card. De Bruyne! Gets it back. Gabriel Jesus. Gundawan. It's Gundawan! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. Tries to dink it in. Rashford. Gundawan. Hoists it forward. And the weighted pass. Nicely measured pass. Sterling. Sterling. Massive leap! Octomine. Gabriel Jesus battles to win it back. Mores! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. That's what all good teams do these days. Pressing from the front is highly effective. Sure. Manchester United to retain the ball, but are seemingly in no rush to break forward. Mares. Precious little by way of goal mouth action yet. Stones tries to get it forward quickly. Bruno Fernandes. Maguire. Fred, and it's played forward. He's pinged one. It's Martial! It's in! Well, players of his stature just live for moments like that. Another really important contribution as we near half time, and it can make such an impact on each mindset. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Ruben Diaz. And it's Rashford. Dinks one in. Oh, that's clever. Hits one! Good effort, and it is right on half-time. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It's very, very tight. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half time because it proved they've not really been at it so far. And if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. is back on the way Manchester don't need to press the panic button just yet they may have to tweak their their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in the second half they can't hold back though Shaw looks to dink one in hit long and direct Room for a shot, has a goal! 
Good run, lovely take, but that is where it stopped. Rashford fully deserves the plaudits for setting up the chance. looking Gabriel Jesus Mares Stones Stones to play it forward Sterling threads one through Sterling has brushed Gabriel That is a late call, but it's the right one. Oh, his goal-scoring celebrations are going to be cut short. The flag was up for offside, even if the referee didn't spot it straight away. The moment's uncertainty there, but it is the right call. Zinchenko. We can assume that they've been instructed by the boss to, to stay in attack. They're just looking to break, aren't they? Yeah, the key now is just to get the ball to them as soon as possible. Zinchenko. Now it's Sterling. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Well, he's playing innocent. He has every reason to. Well, the ref's been lenient here. Well, I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Well... With him already been on a yellow, he should know much better than that. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Cleared without complication. Right through the middle. McTominay. He's one on one, surely! He's had a shot! Just off target. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Forward it goes. Ruben Diaz. Your impression so far, Jim? Manchester are now matching their opponents blow for blow despite the scoreline. No shrieking violence out there. Shaw gets good distance on it. And it's Gundawan. Sinchenko looks to thread it through. Manchester showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Yeah. Hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. Oh, shooting chance! De Bruyne. And De Bruyne! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating the problem for themselves then, but he was onto it so quickly and very nearly made them pay. Ball through needs to be good here. Going through. Big chance! Jao Cancelo can hoist it clear. Mares conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Gets the better of his man. He's gone for it! It's in! Right back in it! Almost no time remaining. Game still on. And how about that for a volley? Executed to perfection. Oh, wonderful, just wonderful, what technical dreams are made of, it was unstoppable. No 
both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, that goal just serves to give them the momentum and psychological edge now at this stage, but for me, they've got to chase a winner. De Bruyne. He's gone for goal! Oh, that's a waste. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Lindelof plays it forward. Manchester really looking like men possessed. They need to if they want to win it. Manchester showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. And the finish! Goal! Manchester United! Into the lead once more. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. The changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. So we have a breakthrough. Now how will things develop from here? Yeah, it's been their hard work that has got him this lead, but I just wonder whether they can keep it up. This may take a toll now. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. De Bruyne, Stones spreads it towards the left. Big and the shot! Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation. And it needs to be any time now, really. How about Sterling? That's caused the worry or two. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. <laughs> Lindelof takes it over to the other flank. Matic. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. A fine advertisement for attacking football, a really entertaining game. So many talking points. In a way, a shame anybody had to lose. Thoughts on what we've just seen? And we know that derbies can often make predictions look silly. They can take on a, a personality of their own, and this one didn't really deserve to have a loser. Thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all